hey my pretties welcome back so today i have a few things to share with you i picked up a little bit of a little bit of stuff <laughs> a little bit of stuff here and there um and so i just of course want to share them with you i am doing a review on some items that i picked up at walmart some of it i could not get my hands on i know i mentioned it in my in a live video and some of you guys said you were trying to order it online and it was sold out this stuff went fast just like last year the same thing happened around christmas but we'll get to that so i have a couple things um i think like one thing from target something from marshall's something from walmart so a little bit of, of just random items that i have been picking up so i think what we're going to do is just go ahead and jump into the review first okay so it seems like every year now dove is starting to drop these like holiday lines of, of amazingness of things that smell so good last christmas i know i remember picking up like the sugar cookie body wash there were some body scrubs and all this good stuff right so for fall and I'm wondering if they're gonna if they're going to drop some more stuff for like Christmas like the sugar cookie line it could be I don't know what would they do peppermint last year it was peppermint bark so I don't know if they're going to drop anything else for Christmas but for right now they did put out some stuff for fall and you guys it was hard to get some of this when I went into the store the deodorants and stuff was there the body washes and the scrubs there was only one body wash left the other ones were sold and so i had to settle for some of the body scrubs so let me show you what i'm talking about so the only body wash that i was able to grab which i really wanted the other um body wash which was it was going to be the i'm looking at the deodorant the putter the putter <laughs> the peak <laughs> sometimes i'll tell you the pecan butter crunch so i was able to get the apple cider caramel dove body wash that's what the container looks like right there of course it is limited edition it says holiday treats i just feel like this is for fall so fingers crossed that they have some stuff coming out for um christmas it says treats for the shower please don't devour <laughs> uh spice up your shower with the scent of warm apple cider topped with whipped cream and a drizzle of caramel let the rich creamy in and it talks about that feel it, it'll make your shower feel like a crisp autumn day you guys the apple cider caramel it smells just like apple cider and caramel oh my god it is you guys it smells so good i am so sad that i was not able to get the other two i'm gonna keep my eyes open for them fingers crossed that i stumble across the other two now the other two scents that i'm talking about that matches the apple cider caramel and the deodorants smell exactly the same they smell so good so good so this is the apple cider caramel deodorant that matches that body wash and these were i believe 6.97 the body wash was oh i can't remember i can't remember i think it was the same price but i could be wrong i'll check give me a second and then the other scents that they had that came in the deodorants the body wash and the body scrubs were the cinnamon pumpkin pie and this one right here the one i said putter <laughs> pecan butter crunch oh my goodness every last one of these smells amazing however this one the pecan butter crunch it made me immediately want to just go get a bowl of butter pecan ice cream i am waiting to use this um i don't feel like i want to use it right now in the middle of summer but once i do i feel like oh my goodness <laughs> i feel like if you use this and you use one of your favorite sweet like gourmand scent perfumes maybe some lotion oh this would pair really wet really good with probably the eos vanilla cashmere oh my goodness put that lotion on one of your you know favorite sweet perfumes or something with this you'll be walking around smelling like a whole snack <laughs> um this smells really really good i love this the cinnamon pumpkin pie um reminds me of oh you get the cinnamon in this it reminds me of cinnamon pumpkin pie 
but for me when i smelled it and the kids smelled it we said it smelled just like sweet potato pie same thing potato potato not the same but the same you know what i mean <laughs> but the cinnamon pumpkin pie smells just as good very very sweet and the apple cider caramel smelled just like the other one now the the body scrubs also came in the two cents i didn't get the apple cider caramel in this one uh i just wanted these two cents which was the pecan butter crunch and the cinnamon pumpkin pie I like Dove's um, body scrubs. I did use the ones from last Christmas. However, I've said it before a million times, the granules of salt or whatever they're using in here, sugar, whatever it is, is too, um, it's too fine for me. I like mine to be a little more coarse, more like when you get tree hut. You know how it's a, it's a little more rough? Like, I don't know, I just like that feeling when I do my scrubs this one just kind of feels too light for me however i will use these they do work very well they're very moisturizing however i just like mine to be a little bit more coarse than these but i had to pick them up um they also uh included the men so when i showed my sons this they were like oh okay so the first one is dove men care mint chocolate martini yeah um it smelled just like what it's called <laughs> it smells like a whole container of chocolate mint ice cream literally my sons were like mm, i don't know if i wear that one so i don't know we're on the fence with this one it smells really sweet but i'm telling you it smells just like a container of ice cream um the next one was hot toddy and we all know what a hot toddy is this one is more um it just smells like a man's cologne or something to me uh it doesn't give you like any notes or anything i mean it's just hot toddy so it's very very uh, i can't think of the word it's nice it's 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 a masculine scent um it reminds me of like axe or something else like that but it's it's really nice it's not like a scent that you would think only comes out in fall but it is a weird little you know little name hot toddy who would have thought that they would have some deodorant that smelled like hot toddy but it smells really really nice the other one that they came out with for men is the apple cider and bourbon right here and i can't remember what this one smells like it smells like a cup of apple cider with a splash of bourbon <laughs> it definitely smells like apple cider i don't really smell the bourbon um but you definitely get what you're getting at, uh, for the name so i thought those were really cool um to have included the men with some scents for fall just like the women's and if you are able to see these they're they're gonna go fast so if you're in walmart tomorrow today check out these see if they have them if you can get you that pecan butter crunch if you're if you're a sweet lover try to get your hands on that one i don't know if they're available online if i could link any of this online down below in the comment section i will okay moving on the next thing i picked up was from target i showed you guys these cute little ghosts at the dollar spot for five dollars i did i had to get me one i mean i had to <laughs> no excuses and it was just a little ghost container looks like that super cute and i knew these were gonna go super fast so i said i need one and i got the ghost from the dollar spot his little face is so cute look with his little smile <laughs> so i got that and then moving over to where did i pick this up tj maxx yeah tj maxx i did choose to get this cute little candy dish i'm gonna fill it with some candies and put it in my daughter's room when we start to decorate and so I just thought this would be cute for her to have her little favorite candy in it and put it next to her computer or whatever. And you have the little ghost on top right there with holding the little peppermint, I believe. So this was $15 and I found this at TJ Maxx. I'm sure they're at Marshall's as well. These pins right here came from Marshall's for $5.99. They're gel pins. I don't know if my daughter's gonna want them. Um, she's, an, she's an artist. I love gel pins. She's probably gonna be like, mom, I don't need those. If she doesn't want them, guess where they're gonna go? On Poshmark, so uh, I'll know soon. But they're just the cute little Hello Kitty pins. Um, yeah. 
they didn't say what colors they were so i'm not too sure but i love the pictures on there the little frankenstein and all of that so you get the is it five five gel pens for six dollars so another thing that i picked up from marshall's is this super cute ghost doormat it was fifteen dollars had to get it i had to um i don't know i just like their little i like the way they're shaped and i, don't know, I just had to get that <laughs> would i tell you guys it was 15 15 dollars next up we have the witch that i recently just showed you guys in tj maxx in a tj maxx walkthrough however i did pick this one up at marshall's and it is this witch lady right here i said it in that video i don't usually pick up witches i really don't um but i just like her dress it reminds me of the wiz uh or the wizard of oz and it made me think of the new movie that's coming wicked because you know how the the girl the witch is she's green and so i don't know i just like it i think the bottom is different it's kind of cute it also reminded me of one of those toys when we were younger the little ball toy that used to just when you was a baby and it would just rock around like this like the weeble wobbles to, uh weeble wobble toys that's what i i was thinking about i wish she did that like the whole little rocking thing like that so i thought she was really really cool very unique for only 20 dollars. so i had to get her we are almost done next up i did get uh the beetlejuice jacket from walmart i wanted one of these so I just got this and if I'm not mistaken, it was, um, how much did I pay for this? I don't know. I think it was like $16, $16 for this. I just love the green and the way it looked. They had a few Beetlejuice, um, items and stuff that I showed you guys when we did the walkthrough. There's nothing on the back, but yeah, this was the one that I wanted just cause I like the way that looks across the chest. So I went with that one. I was at Ross and I saw this blanket. It is Betsy Johnson and i'm like i gotta pick that up i thought it was super cute it's not really thick like you know how you get the real thick blankets as you can see it's kind of thin but it'd be a cute little throw blanket to throw over like the couch or the armchair or something when that time comes but betsy johnson uh this was 13 dollars. this blanket is my favorite find besides my beetlejuice blanket this has to be those two to me are tied i love my beetlejuice blanket I don't know, I might love this one a little more. Because I'm a, I'm a big Scooby-Doo <laughs> fan. I love me some Scooby-Doo. So, are they upside down? They are upside down. So, here's the back. So, this is this blanket right here. I saw this. If you watched that video, I was like, oh, no, they didn't. Stop the press. A Scooby-Doo Halloween blanket? I'm getting that. <laughs> um, so, I did get this. At some point, there will be one in my Poshmark closet because I found two and I picked up two so I just figured I don't know if one of you guys really like Scooby-Doo then you'll be able to get one of these too because I hadn't seen these before so how much was it $16.99 we have three more items and I'll be done so this blanket right here not sure if we're gonna keep it or not but I thought it was really different really cute and I'm trying to convince my daughter to let me do her room decorate her room with ghosts because I have like some ghost pieces even the one that just came from the Target dollar spot so I saw this and I'm like oh this would be so cute on her bed so it's a ghost blanket and that's the and it's a big one too so that's the top of it and that's the bottom and so as you can see his eye his cheek and the mouth and this is what it would look like on the bed so you just spread it out across your bed it has that gray border at the bottom of it right there and how cute is that so you would just walk in your room and have this big ghost laying on your bed and there's the gray bottom right there i don't know i just i like this i thought it was cute so i'm trying to convince her i don't know if she's gonna want it <laughs> it was 25 dollars. it is 50 by 70 inches and the brand is in vogue i found another frankenstein cup i've been trying to cut back on picking up items that are frankenstein um i've seen a few things that i passed on uh man um uh, what am i trying to say frankenstein heads some statues i've seen a few things even some other cups and i was like nope 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 and then there's then these there's these few pieces that still jump out at me and it's like get me 
So this one I had to get because the green, which I love is on the inside, but then it's purple and you know, I love purple. So I got it cause of that. <laughs> Uh, $4.99 from Marshalls. And last but not least, I have this one item that I had, it's so big, I had to put it on my kitchen counter to show you guys. I was in Marshalls and I found this and you guys, I was so wrong. <laughs> I thought it was a um, snow globe when I seen it in the store, so I bought it and I didn't really think about it until I got home, like that's not a big snow globe. Um, I'm gonna show it to you guys, but I'm actually gonna take it back. I don't want it. I think it's cool for $25, but it's just it's just not for me. If it would have been a snow globe, I would have kept it, but it's not, so let me show you. So this is that item that I seen at Marshall's. It's like a really big book, and um, it has the little glass in the front, and I thought it was a snow globe because it has the on-off switch right here. I did put some batteries in there. I'm gonna show you what it does. So as you can see, the lights come on, but hold on. Can you hear it? So that's what it does. And then it just repeats itself over and over and over. And although it's a really big piece, I just, I don't know, it's just not for me. I just, I'm gonna take it back. $25, not too bad, but yeah, it's going back to the store. <laughs> so that's it, you guys, for this haul. Um, yeah, I really wanted to share with you guys the Dove products. Um, but I'm gonna wrap this up. So I thank you for watching. Like I said, if I can find any of these items, they will be linked down below for you guys. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're new. And I'll see you guys real soon in my next video. Okay, bye you guys.